here you'll see a queen cup. However, this is a little more or a little less common because it's in the middle of the frame. If it were towards the bottom of the frame down here, it would be a swarm cell or swarm cup. But because it's in the middle of the frame, it's generally for supersedure, which is the bees replacing the queen due to uh, maybe she's getting a little too old or just isn't laying as well anymore. So mistakes can be made. We opened up this nuke box. I had set in the calendar that in three days from now, uh, a queen is supposed to emerge. Well, I forgot when I put in a frame of eggs, the eggs are already about three days old. So I should have subtracted three days from my 16 day uh, emergent on the calendar. When we opened today, we saw that it had been freshly opened from the bottom so when you're looking at a uh, queen cell or super seizure cell if the bottom is opened in a nice little circle then you're good to go she's come out on her own if it's chewed in from the side then that means either she or the workers have gone through and and killed her now i have no idea how many queens emerged because all of them were out um there was a couple that looked like they might just be cups or they could be cells with queens that had emerged. Mistakes are made. We're going to learn from it. We're going to wait and see what happens. The bees are really calm, which tells me maybe only one emerged or two, and we're good to go. I didn't see any dead queens laying on the bottom board or out in the front. Okay, this is a queen swarm cell. You'll notice it's opened from the bottom down here. It's a nice round hole, which indicates that this is the queen that emerged first. Other swarm cells, if we find any in this, in this hive, generally will be chewed from the side, which means that the other bees have accepted the first queen and are killing all of the others. I'm gonna do a, a short video of it and I'm gonna take some pictures as well. Fine. To put the marshmallow over the hole. In. Yeah, over yeah. the hole. That's right, fine. We got the venting box there. You got the queen. You're there. recording. I'm recording. Oh, okay. So I just pick her up by the wings, typically by the thorax, and I just put my finger over her and let up a little bit, and then boom, she's in. All right. Here, let go. Oops. Here we go. I and we have a mark under my finger. Yeah, we have a mini marshmallow in this end down here, and then we'll put one in the other end as well to keep her trapped in there, and then the workers will chew it out. All right, here we have the queen that we just put in this Benton box, homemade Benton box cage. And we did not put any attendants in with her because she's going straight into another hive. But you can see the worker still taking care of her. They came out of the hive, followed her over here, trying to help her out. And even you have a worker over here trying to let her loose. 
a jailbreak. An attempted jailbreak. Not going to happen. A special thank you to all of you, our viewers. Because of all of your help, and especially the support of our members, we were able to donate two hives to a local school.